Hey guys, the River and Worm here with a Pistons tutorial. In this series of videos, I'm going to be showing you how to make a variety of piston devices that I featured in my uh, Pistons preview video. In this first episode, I'm going to be showing what turned out to be the most popular feature of my video, the pop-up dog dispenser. <laughs> It's a really simple device to make, but it will uh, let us move on to making more complicated devices. So let me just pick a test subject here and move on to the tutorial. Okay, we have our test subject loaded into a visible version of the dog dispenser so that you can see the piston action. As you can see one piston fires lowering him down into a safe spot in the ground and another covers him up. Now to get this timing we use this little device the reversible signal generator and this is a very handy and compact little way to uh, get your pistons to fire in proper order. And I'm going to show you how to make one of these. Now making one of these is really simple. All you have to do is lay out four blocks like so with one space in between each block. And you want to pick one block as your input. It doesn't really matter which one, but you have to think about how you're going to hide this and where you want your final input and outputs to be. Now, I'm going to choose this to be my input, this block here. Now, after you've chosen your input, just pick any two of the other blocks and place torches on the front like so. Then you come back to your input block and add your repeaters two here facing away from the input and then you just go around in a clockwise manner placing in the other repeaters now add delay to the repeater between the torches and the other repeater back here opposite it and you have a reversible signal generator now this device is really handy as you can see because the torches will go off in one sequence and come back on in the reverse this torch goes off first and comes on second that is how we get the timing to make sure our dog doesn't get crushed and it, it also comes in handy when you're trying to say attach pistons to other pistons they have to fire and reverse in the proper order or they get all screwed up now let's look at the connections here since this first redstone torch goes off first and comes on second I've connected it to the bottom piston ensuring that this piston will retract first. This signal comes up here to this other piston, the one that covers up the dog, but if you'll notice here I had to invert the signal. The redstone comes in the back of this block and that powers this torch off. And this torch will power my piston here. It's a very compact way to get this done. And uh, the reason that has to be inverted is I want this piston to be closed and therefore the dispenser to be open while this piston is extended. You can see the signal generator gives them the right timing. And there you have it. I hope you guys enjoyed my video on how to make the pop-up dog dispenser. 
Next time I'm going to be making a little more complicated device with pistons, also using the reverse signal generator. Be sure to like my videos and leave a comment, and subscribe if you haven't already. Uh, thanks for watching. Later.